I hate disloyal people so much. More than anything in this whole entire world. People who can't be loyal. And I don't just mean this in the sense of like, oh, relationships and cheating, although I hate that too. But friends who are disloyal. There's nothing I hate more than a disloyal person you don't even understand. Because, okay, I am one of the most loyal people you will ever meet. And I'm not saying that I'm one of the best people that you'll ever meet, like, morally. I'm aware of, like, whilst I would say that I'm a kind person and I try to do my best and be there for others, like, I am aware that because of some of, like, my issues, my self-destructive tendencies can sometimes kind of bleed onto other people if I don't kind of watch myself and make sure that I'm being kind. And, like, there have been times when I have hurt people as a result of, like, some of my tendencies. But I try my best to, like, keep a lid on that and make sure that I don't hurt those around me. But I'm a very, very loyal person. Like, my friends and the people who I love, I would die for them. Not even just die for them. Like, my bestest friends in the world, if someone was, like, if, if you die right now, it will guarantee that your best friend will have, like, a great life, get into their dream university, get their dream job. I'd do it. I'd just be like, okay, kill me. I I'm dead, I guess. Um, my camera isn't focusing. Hi! Um, but anyways. <sighs> and, like, my dearest, closest people, I know that they are loyal to me. And, like, my loyalty to people is just utterly unfaltering. Um, and the only exceptions I'll make is, like, if I see that they're actually a bad person. Like, if I have a friend and I find out that they're cheating on their partner, I don't care, I'm telling their partner, because I would hate to be in that position. Like, if someone was cheating me on, on me, I'd want to know. And that's not a secret I'm going to keep, because that doesn't align with my morals. Or, like, if I found out my friend was, like, a murderer or something, I'd... Okay, actually, it depends why. <laughs> Okay, but if I found out, like, my friend was a pedophile or something, I'd tell the police. Um, but... So, okay, it's focused. Um, but, like, I can't remember what I was saying. Um, but anyways. Yeah, I would, I would do anything for my friends. Unless, like, you know, I find out that they're doing something that I really think is morally wrong. Or if, like, I realise that they wouldn't do the same for me. Like, I've had situations where I've had a friend who, like, I start realising that they really don't value me as much as I value them. Or, like, they just, they wouldn't do the same for me. Like, if I really, really needed their help, they wouldn't be there for me. Then I will s cut it off. And I'll be like, okay, you don't get my, like, super special friendship perks anymore. You don't get my unfaltering, undying loyalty anymore. But apart from that... STOP! How do you make your camera focus? Um... Mm, I'm so mentally well. Oh, the side of my fringe is too long. <laughs> I hate my fringe. I cut my own fringe. Because I'm scared of hairdressers. Hmm... Um, anyways, <laughs> um, yeah, but I hate disloyal people so much because, like, w okay, specifically what made me want to talk about this on camera is because there's, like, my least favourite thing in the world is people who are like, oh, I don't want to pick sides. I hate conflict. I don't want to pick a side. I'm always just like, I'm, I'm not going to choose sides. Like, shut up. You have to, though. You have to choose a side, because if you care about your friends, or just, like, the people you love, then you will be on their side. Like, yes, conflict is horrible, and you don't want to be involved in it. No one does, apart from, like, really fucked up people. But at a certain point, if you want to stay loyal to your friends, and show them that you love them and care about them, you'll choose their side. You will, like, I will always choose my friend's side. Like... Uh, I forgot what I was saying because I heard a weird noise in my house and I got freaked out. No, yeah, but people who, like, don't pick sides, people who are like, oh, I just, I don't choose sides. Like, shut the hell up so you're not loyal. You're disloyal to your friends. Like, okay, for example, people who, like, stay friends with their friends' exes because they're like, oh, I don't want to pick sides. Like, 
why not? Why don't you want to side with your friend? You should want to. Like, if, if, okay, if your, like, friend is still actually on good terms with her ex and is like, yeah, it's okay, you can stay friends with my ex, then whatever. But people who, like, had a bad breakup and, like, don't want their ex still in their life, if you're, like, staying friends with their ex, like, you're hurting your friend because you're, like, you're dragging the ex back into their life and, like, it adds this extra level of anxiety of, like, oh, my ex could be, like, talking shit about me with my friend. Or it's just, like, you know, if that ex in question has, like, done some genuinely morally questionable things, like, why, why are you siding with that? Why are you okay with that? Do you not trust your friend enough to just think, like, yeah, this is a bad person, maybe they had good reasons for breaking up with them, I'm gonna cut them off too! Hmm? That's crazy! Um, but, like, yeah, you can't just, you, look, you can't just, like, not take sides forever. You have to eventually take the side of the people you care about, otherwise you're not loyal. Because, I don't know, if you expect your friends to be there for you and care about you no matter what, you have to do the same for them. And I would, I would go to any lengths to make my friends feel happy and comfortable. And that's because I know that they're good people and I know that they would do the same for me. But fake friends who claim to be like, oh, you're such a good friend, I care about you so much, but then just don't take your fucking side. Like, you are an actual snake. And it's like, I don't know. I feel like a, a lot of these types of people who just, like, don't take sides, they just want to give themselves a pat on the back for, like, oh, I'm such a good person. Like, I, I always avoid conflict. I'm such a pacifist. I don't start arguments. But, like, you do. You're causing conflict by not picking a side. You're literally betraying your friend. You should side with your friend no matter what. And at a certain point, if you if there's, like, a situation where you don't really know who to side with, then, like, that's so tough. I know it's really stressful, but you kind of have to at some point because you must, deep down, know who you think is morally in the right. You must have someone who you agree with more or someone who you love and trust more who you want to side with. And if you don't, then, like, why are you, why are you even, like, involved in either of them? Um... But also people who, like, don't value others' loyalty is so annoying. Like, I, I, mm, I've known some people who just, like, value quali- quantity over quality way more when it comes to friends. And who would, like, exchange in the blink of an eye, like, one really, really good friend who would absolutely die for them. With, like, a group of, like, ten friends who, like, aren't that loyal to them, but are, like, fun to go out with. And, like, that's shitty. Because those people, in, like, ten years, that you're not still gonna love them. That you're not going to trust them with your every secret but like that one special friend who would have done anything for you you've just wasted them anyways i hate disloyal people i hate dishonesty bye